Well, we're certainly going to have some big swings yeah, over the so next few days. Spring like weather, winter like weather, all in the next seven days. Some real winter like weather. Real winter. Not feeling like it, but actually looking like it again. So, first and foremost, we do have warmer weather for this weekend. It is going to feel like April. We've been uh, talking about that uh, for many, many days now. Uh, and while the weekend does not feature a washout at any point, there is a chance for a late day shower on Saturday. That's uh, toward an after sunset and a situation where many towns likely remain dry and any rain that we have again will be fairly light. But we're focused, of course, on Tuesday of next week. We've upgraded our first alert to a first alert weather day. Uh, and here's what we know as of right now and keep in mind this is still very fluid we're several days out uh, from the first flakes or first bits of precipitation falling from the sky uh, but as of the current thoughts and thinkings of our first alert weather team both the morning and evening commutes on Tuesday could be impacted uh, from this precipitation uh, the storm center is going to take a track as of now a little bit farther offshore uh, than uh, one that would be closer that would bring us that mix so it is a colder snowier solution for us as of right now. Still some uncertainties regarding the start and end times. Uh, at one point, the models were 10, 12, 14, 24 hours apart. They've been getting closer uh, and how much snow exactly to anticipate. We're going to be ironing that out as well through the weekend and into early next week. But here, for instance, look at the start time on uh, the American, the European model. Uh, certainly a little bit snowier on the Euro than compared to, uh, compared to the American model. But look how quickly things wrap up on the Euro. Meanwhile, on the American model, uh, we're looking specifically here at Tuesday 6 p.m. still ongoing all across uh, southern New England. So uh, in the meantime, it is April like warmth that is on the way for tomorrow. Today warmer than yesterday, tomorrow warmer than today. We're right now between 45 and 50 inland mid 40s along the 95 quarter thanks to around a 40 degree water temperature in the sound and that southerly flow. But regardless, we're uh, two to five, seven degrees warmer uh, in many locations compared to this time yesterday. And our ICAN view from Waterbury 46 in the Brass City, uh, beautiful sunset uh, currently underway. A nice one as well from southeast Connecticut checking in there uh, in, in Mystic. So we had some spotty sprinkles, flurries, uh, cloud cover this morning all in association with this push of milder air. Uh, so notice Bangor, Maine right now 37. We're 50 at Brainerd Airport in Hartford but uh, looking westward Pittsburgh 61. So uh, that warmer air to our west heads in our direction for tomorrow. So overnight tonight we'll bottom out uh, in the mid to even upper 30s. We'll see an increase in cloudiness and get some areas of fog to, to develop. And then as we head through the day tomorrow, we'll eventually see more clouds and sunshine. And here comes a little disturbance with a front. Uh, this is again as we head past sunset tomorrow, best chance of seeing some isolated showers. Temps tomorrow warm into the mid and upper 50s inland lower 50s along the 95 quarter again feeling more like April the records for tomorrow the 10th of February 62 at both uh, Hartford and as well for uh, Bridgeport set very recently just one year ago so on our first alert seven day forecast uh, Sunday is cooler relatively speaking of course to tomorrow but still temps about 10 degrees above average upper 40s low 50s under a mix of sun and clouds we start the new work week dry highs in the 40s we've got that first alert weather day for Tuesday and then beyond that temperatures will be trending a bit chillier mid 30s for highs on Wednesday for Valentine's Day dry weather breezy so that wind will make it feel even chillier and the 35 to 40 degree range by Thursday with increasing cloudiness maybe some afternoon and evening flurries and then Friday of next week as of now still chilly highs in the 30s under a mix of sun and clouds all right